Hey guys, I'm Nick, aka the Wonder in Nick's Games, and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how you can change config files in your uh, your mod pack. So first off, let's go ahead and get our multi MC open, which is gonna be right here. Once that's open, we want to go ahead and edit instance over here. Then we want to go to loader mods right here and then click view folder. We've done this before. Now we want to go ahead and click on dot or Minecraft right here. This is under, next to mods at the top. See Minecraft. Click on that. We've done that before. Now, however, we've not done this before. We want to go ahead and go into config. And here are all of the config files associated with your mod packs. Now, you can go in here and edit these if, for example, you wanted to limit whether or not, you know, zombie pigmen in the nether get automatically angry when you mine nether ores, which is actually a thing that mechanism can do. Um, if you don't want that to happen, you can come in here and disable that. Now, most of these you can just double click on them, right? And you can get like a big long file of this stuff. And, and some of them are, are easier to read than others. Like, for example, this one, you can actually kind of understand a little bit. Maybe you make sure word wraps on it is. You can actually kind of understand this one a little bit more, as you can see. Like, you can read it and it's readable, but usually the, that one's not a good example. Actually, none of the mods I currently have installed are a good example. But usually you can click on these and it's actually a, a nice readable file right like this. You can go through, you can change stuff, you can do things, you can do some small tweaks, and it doesn't matter what you do here, and you might be like, Nick, help me! I can't. I literally cannot, because every single mod is different. Every single one of them is different as to what you change in your config files. I mean, you could go in and you could change everything from, like, some mods allow you to do everything in the mod, basically, can be turned on or off. Open Blocks is a good example of that, and, and, and ex Extra Utilities is another one where you can just basically turn off everything in the mod and only keep the stuff that you want. And other mods are like, no, screw you, man. Screw you. It doesn't matter. I'm not, I'm, this is my mod. It's going to work like I want it to work. It's going to have the features I wanted to have, and if you don't like that, then don't use the mod. So it just really depends, and what I would recommend doing is when you install a new mod, you're like, uh, I don't really like this feature. Well, then come back. To, uh, to, to, you know, the config files here. Find the config for the mod. It might be hard to find. It might be, for example, inside of a NEI folder or something similar. Like, you know, if you downloaded Mechanism, it might be in the Mechanism folder or something like that. Search it out, find it, right? And then open it up and look in the config. Maybe you can change it. Don't expect to change it, but maybe you can change it. Editing config files is one of the things that makes mod packs unique. You know, if you're building a, a mod pack that's a lot like FTB mod-wise, that's fine. But if you change the configs like a ton, it could be completely different from what FTB has going on. Literally by just doing the configs differently than they did them. It's pretty cool stuff, guys. So don't be afraid to play around with configs. This is a really short and simple video. I just wanted to show you how to get here. I'll cover how to get here one more time. To do that, you again just want to open up MultiMC, hit Edit Instance, go to Loader Mods, click View Folder. And then click on Minecraft, and then go into config. It's that simple. And here on your config files, you can edit those, change them, do whatever you want to them. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm Nick's Games. Thank you so much for watching. And I'm out, guys. Peace. And I forgot to mention at the end there, but this video is sponsored by Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to nicksgamescom slash Apex to get an awesome Minecraft server, 24-hour server, DDoS protected, everything for just $3 a month. It's incredible. First link down below. NixGames.com slash Apex. See you guys. Uh, see you guys later. Bye! And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. Down that we've got episode one of this series. Do you want to see how to install multi-MC? Like maybe you missed that part but ended up on episode two. Well then go check out that video because it shows you how to do that. It's episode one of the How to Make a Mod Pack series. And down the other we've got Nick Tech, which is my epic and awesome Minecraft Let's Play series of my very own mod pack, Nick Tech. It's like a technology-based mod pack and that video is a tutorial slash let's play of it. Go check it out. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm Nick's Games. More mod pack tutorials or how to make a mod pack tutorials coming in the coming week. And uh, I'm out, guys. Peace. Bye.